How's it going everyone? Welcome back to our channel. Today we're gonna to watch One Piece episode 746. Last episode ended with the Straw Hat fleet establishing. Let's see where they'll be headed up to next. If you'd like to help support our channel, our Patreon link is down in the description below. You'll get early access to all the videos that we post onto our YouTube channel and get full on car reactions to the One Piece series. So if you're interested in those, make sure to check it out. Now on to the anime. Thank you show. Happy music. <laughs> Oh my god. He's Bounce Man. <laughs> he, he's sitting on his knees. <laughs> so horrible. I can't see it. I can't see She's gonna join us. Why? Robin oh, wants him to on. stay. <laughs> Leave me. No, Robin wants him to stay because he's the only one that has brains around here like her. Oh yeah, maybe actually. <laughs> She's like, finally, some an intellect I can talk with. <laughs> Who's that? that? That's... Is that Kaku? Is that his name? Is that Spandam? Yeah. Oh my! Oh my god, Robin is getting sick of it. Oh my god, he's getting sick of it. It's Luchi! Luchi is the boss! Spandam, he God. lost. Yeah. Damn. Yo, what's happening? They're back. Luchi got promoted, oh and Spandam got demoted. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, this place looks so clean. Now. Oh, 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 <laughs> let's go, guys. Yeah. Damn, that dress. Dress Rosa. Zempo Hewa Ijo Nas. Stots Minani Teangar Nodanga. Tadaima Goshokaini Azgarimasta. What? What? They all know them. How can they even see them? They're so tiny. Where's the voice? <laughs>。これを作るのかれおか。はいです。お願いしますです。今年は世界会議レベル。Oh, oh. This is it. That's where Fujitora wants to go おとさま。今日のここ、レベッカが食事を作りに来てくれるんです。久しぶりに揃うんだな。家族な。この国を訪れたなら、旅人はあることに驚くだろう。花子さん、おいらっしゃい。レベッカ、マンシェリ。Double princess. <laughs> それは町に溶け濃く自然に人間たちと。おお、またそうキュー。おお、マイガー。おお、マイガー。おお、マイガー。おお、マイガー。おお、マイガー。おお、マイガー。おお、マイガー。おお、マイガー。おお、マイガー
But he's actually in the right though. So he's not going to. Yeah. That, you know? that, that too. A kind of is like even if he's in the wrong oh, oh, oh. Wait, what? あいつはバカだぜ、おつるさん。俺に加勢して、ガキどもを始末してるや。こうはならなかった。この結果だけが現実。<笑> 今の海に頂点と呼べる奴はいるか。この海の王者は誰だ。海の皇帝たち、四皇のうちの歴史の底で綴り続ける。わあ、いけるさ。足が いや、キングオブハーツ。いや、キングオブハーツ。いや、カズノワントクタタイトルオフィシャリー、ライト。ノワントク。ノワンハタパワー。いや。とテイクイトオバー。マストがもう。ウェイ、ワット。イズザ
感は未完。俺は今、もう別に感動している。<笑>マニアックな作り込み。<笑>遊び心満載で、スーパーな愛に満ちあふありがとうございます。フランキー先輩。<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑>何より俺たちが感動していることはこのビブルカードが示す最近にマグダラビーサイバーおまがでハマルフィトラッカーデュー Oh my god この胸にご用心 What? They should make like a replica of this in real life. Straight up, pull up. <laughs> That's all they needed. Bari t o r o m e o Tony Cacuzo, a son of him, got there. Tanunda, the difference in attitude. I love it. Oh, Ruby, do it. I want to touch King Shoki. Oh, let's go. Arima, go on to Negata. This guy. What? Red carpet on. <laughs> <laughs> he threw it away. He doesn't care. <laughs> oh my god, it's cool. Oh my god. Then you celebrate. Whoa, Damn, look, look at this photo. photo. Oh my, it's an updated one. <laughs> Damn, how'd they get her in that angle? Oh no, it got up. <laughs> oh my god. General <laughs> Oh shit. Damn. Who snapped that photo? <laughs> 200. That's high. That's higher than Frankie. That's higher than Sanji, no? Did they show Sanji? Sanji's That's higher than Robin's. Oh. Yeah. Oh, and what's with the picture? They actually got photo of it. Whoa. How did they get that? <laughs> Damn, they're good. Oh, it doubled. Did it double? <laughs> yeah, it did. It was 50 before. <laughs> Why is his thing so cool looking? Yeah, it's like a rock star poster. <laughs> ケンドスミスタヒトタツイガイワチョットコレミテケロクロワスノサンジセンパイワガクノアンガリカタモテハイシモイケドリンオンリーアライフオンナノコトデウラミデモカテウンジャネドカシエネアシャイディンノースオウ
And we don't the Navy know. wants him. That's the true, because like w- someone else wouldn't be able to make shots like that, right? Like who, who decides the bounty posters? Isn't that the Navy? Navy? Is Navy? Yeah. It could be like the Celestial Dragons or something too related to that. Can they do that? Well, I'm just thinking, only the Navy has control on that, and then the only group of people that has Navy power over. The government and the navy would be celestial dragons. Could it be that there's a celestial dragon, kind of like the that, wants, that wants him no. for some reason, still alive. That's crazy. Oh, but that didn't we talk about this before? It's like we don't know the full backstory of technically Zoro and Sanji. True. Right? They're yeah. the only ones that didn't show their past. And then we were so we're suspecting that there could be something, especially because with Zoro, they showed the Revolution Army was like uh, to the base do- at his dojo, dojo yeah. right? That he trained at. So we're like, oh, is there something? Right. Yeah, they kind of leave out the part where like Zoro kind of yeah. like grows up and goes challenge. Like yeah. they just show, yeah, he yeah. showed up, but yeah. that's not really like where. Yeah, he we came don't from. know anything about them technically, like yeah. their child. Yeah, their the, right? the upbringing. Like yeah. Sanji was just on a ship, but it's like, okay, where was yeah, he before that? Exactly. Like also like family and stuff True. as well, right? Because like yeah. I think everybody else we know. Who their family mm-hmm. was or like who they were associated with and like what yeah, happened, true, yeah. right but mm-hmm. like with sanji and soro we still don't know that so maybe it was from before but it's kind of hard to imagine because i would have been like before he was on the ship and everything like the cooking mm-hmm. uh, uh bar- barati barati? Ba- barati barati yeah before he was on that ship so it's like before that he was just like a kid he was just a so kid. like i don't know who would have wanted him already by then Cause she wouldn't even have had a wanted poster by that, unless unless someone he knows is, I don't know, someone he knows is looking for him. But then they have want him alive. But like even if it's a personal connection that wants you to find you and wants you alive, technically speaking, they shouldn't have the power to say they want you back alive, because that's the shots that the navy and the government makes, True. right? Yeah, I guess so. Because then they're here, they're saying, oh, like, it's Sanji. He could have been entangled with, like, you know, s- someone or something like that. But it's, like, over a woman who wants to do the honors himself. Like, some random guy is not going to have the authority to say the, his wanted poster, I want him to be alive only. Mm-hmm. Like, that's something that the government or the Navy would determine, right? And then, so... The only thing I can think of is like Celestial Dragons because Celestial Dragons controlled them. I don't, Celestial I don't know. Dragons or Navy? Because Celestial Dragon, yeah, so either Celestial Dragon or someone within the Navy themselves. But then if it's someone within the Navy themselves that is making that shot, then they have to be someone of high authority already, right? So it has to be like at least like a captain or admiral or whatever it is, right? Maybe not a captain, like, I don't know, like... He's... Vice Admiral or something like who would be able to say that? Like I want that pirate, but, but why, alive. But why would they want him alive? That's the weird thing. Maybe they, maybe they have something that they have to resolve. But it's still kind of weird because he, the because the issue would have been from before he was in the ship. Then it would be right? or, or or something the, that happened during the or the time the skip. Way. During oh, the true. time skip, along or this way. whole thing's like a troll thing, kind of like his last way. one. Oh, you remember like his last one yeah um like that photo of him yeah it is him but doesn't that look like when he was like running yeah. after a lady or something and they snatched that photo of him? true there's like a, a fish oh this is this is based in fishman island uh-huh and he's chasing mermaids uh-huh. or huh. they want him alive was it like that before too what was his poster before oh, also only alive or dead? No, it was alive. dead and alive. It's only now. It's only now. The price has gone up it? strangely high, and the text is odd. Is what mm. he's saying. Because before it was dead and alive. Because dead or alive, right? Before it was dead or alive. For, so for, for some reason, now it's. Is it because before it was dead or alive? Because the picture. It was the first time that they had uh, a bounty on him. Right, and then that bounty, and then that bounty photo spread. So whoever had the authority or whatever to tell them to change it to only a lie saw it, 
So for whoever wants Sanji, saw that first initial poster and said, "I oh, I know him. Mm. I'm looking for him." Mm-hmm. And then they changed it somehow to now only alive because they realized that that was him. So me someone so, so someone's looking for him. So someone's looking for and him and wants him alive for They want reason. they want him alive. That's why yeah. the price is high now. Yeah. Cuz it's gone up. Yeah. Strange. But high. only for alive. So they want mm. them to capture him. Yeah. Damn, that's crazy. We'll have to see. Oh my god. The so much They're stuff. trying to do a Sanji thing here. But yeah, maybe it'll be like a small Sanji like arc, a or, Sanji something. arc or something. Not, uh, not Sanji arc, but like maybe like Sanji reveals. Kind of like back when with Luffy, they suddenly started revealing like all the stuff about him and his brothers. Bro- brothers and, and sisters and, and like dragon and, and everything. Stuff. Yeah. <laughs> something like that. Oh, yeah, maybe. maybe. That, that could be it. Yeah. They'll give him yeah. like. Something juicy yeah. like that. Dude, this ship is so cool. <laughs> I can't. It's so funny. I love it. The Barto Club. Barto Club. Yes. <laughs> it's so cool. It's awesome. I love the detailing. It's so funny. It does look like um, like fan art. <laughs> yeah. And also it's so nerdy. You know? It, is, it, it does is. give it the vibe. It's like you go into some, an anime fan's room or something. This is kind of like... The vibe you would expect, you would expect anime stuff yeah, around, that's, you know? that's the joke that they're <laughs> cool running. Cool anime like, stuff, Barto you know? Club. Okay, oh my god, there was so much happening, we gotta go back to all of that. After the incident, what's he talking about? Is he is he at Dressosa right that now? That is Dressosa, yeah, right? that's Dressosa. So they're talking about the weapons and stuff, we're all yeah, gone. at the bottom. Dude, this was He's so kissing funny. up right now. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, Luchi. <laughs> what the fuck? You're still here, bro. And the pigeon The pigeon too. is still here. <laughs> is he running CP0? Is CP0? Oh, wait, is it? Because... Why would CP9 be here, right? Because they intro it, it said CP0 or whatever, like the A- Aegis. Oh yeah! Wait, what? They took over CP0? They have CP9 Because they're wearing the white outfits. Yeah. So, oh, I totally missed that. I was like, Cyberpool, Aegis, Zero. So are they... So they're not CP9 now, they, they are CP0. They are CP0. They're the ones that were going after Sabo, because Sabo says CP0 is coming after the Revolution Army. And they're looking for the weapons and everything, so they're go- they're the ones going after Sabo. True. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. Yeah. So they're coming back. I remember the Sabo was saying they're coming back. Yeah, yeah. The CP zero members that we saw with Dofi, like, were they like Bruno and them or something, or the completely new characters? Oh, it could have been. Mm. It could have been. We don't know because they were like in masks. They and were everything. in mask again. There yeah. was one guy that was like pretty huge that could have been Blue No. Mm, maybe, maybe he came back, man. Maybe <laughs> so it's not they, six powers anymore. Maybe, true. He still had the goat. I the, thought the goat died. I was like, the, what happened? The goat wants some noodles. So cute. See, I for this part, I'm like, I'm totally with Fujitora. It's like he should not apologize if he is not in the wrong. True. The thing, the difference is, a Kainu doesn't apologize even if he is in the wrong. That is, that is right, hundred percent true. Yeah. Here, he's just not apologizing because he's not in the wrong. Yeah, like I feel wrong? like that's totally valid. Yeah. Why? Why have to apologize when you yeah. don't do anything wrong? Yeah, that means at that point, it's like he is bowing down to Akainu then, yeah. right? Because even mm-hmm. though he's the one that r- hasn't done anything wrong, he's mm-hmm. still apologizing. Like, why are you apologizing then? Yeah. He's kind of saying like, uh, we're supposed to cover up stuff. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. exactly. Oh, this was good here. I didn't think we were going to hear Dofi again. Yeah, technically, is he trying to scare her to be like, ooh, like you guys fucked up, like you don't know what's coming for he, you? He's, he's saying is something he... big's gonna happen. Yeah, but maybe not directly through him. Yeah, but Su- no, no, that's that is what he's saying because right. he was saying that he was holding the monsters. I was back. controlling them. Yeah, and then now he's like, oh, you guys don't know what's coming for you. Kind of, and then and then Siru is kind of like calling him out on the bullshit, and be yeah. like, no, that's bullshit. And then he's being like laughing because he's yeah. like. I think he was trying to get to her through her head to be like, you guys are fucked, I mean, but she's not he's buying laughing. it at yeah, all. Yeah, that could be it too. <laughs> this is essentially what... um. It's like mind games here. <laughs> this is what Sengoku wanted to do with Law. It's Just lock him up and talk to him. Oh, cut, cut, oh, shit. Okay, so I, is it that like, 
I think he's basically saying that everyone's gonna start fighting, right? Because Kaido is gonna be super angry with like this whole situation, right? So he's gonna cause a whole uh, fuss and everything. But then the whole reasons why the Seven Warlords system even exists is so they can keep the emperors in check and shit, right? But it's like now he's like saying, oh, who's actually controlling the sea? Do you know what I mean? You have all these measures, but it's never been tested. Oh, you're right? The chaos. Yeah. yeah, the chaos has never actually unfolded, right? Like they have all these things in place to kind of keep the mm, the powers, the power balance. Yeah, Where it's like oh, everyone's so powerful. Let's not find out exactly, who's the top. exactly. And right. now they're at the point where it's like they're kind of risking that because Kyle is going to be so enraged with this whole thing yeah. that it's kind of tipped at this mm -hmm. point. So well, he's not going to fight. He hasn't heard the news yet. Yeah, yeah. He fell down. Yeah. He was like, yo, let's start the war or yeah. something. Okay, where did he get those glasses, dude? We saw them. They broke them. That was like how he fell, right? It was like the shat the glasses shattered and his head was like this with like his eyes all like shattered. He, maybe he just he reached into out. his pants and he just pulled in some He just had, he had spares in his pants. <laughs> the family of D have been hiding in the shadows. When I saw them like having that thing nailed to the wood, I'm like, oh, is that, is that Yeah, open? I was like, you guys should have made a whole room the just metal like cage sea prism. Yeah, yeah, something like that, right? <laughs> like this guy made a whole tower out of sea prism and you guys can just make a mini jail cell for him. That's yeah, made of full, sea full sea prism. Like, right? man, it just goes to show, man. He was just like leagues ahead of them. Yeah, right? Or the whole floor could be sea prism. Like that could work too. Isn't that his whole thing was that he wanted to create destroy the world or cause like chaos for the world so that it would like fuck up the celestial dragon? But it's already gonna happen. So that's gonna happen now. I think is that why he's still like chilling? Cause like the way he's reacting doesn't really feel like someone that just got defeated. You know, and but he accepted that he's just gonna be watching from everything from Impel Down. I think he had big plans, but he came to term with him not kind of influencing it, mm. but since how like everything's set up, he he's looking forward to the yeah, chaos because he's chaos. curious. He True. he wants to see. Yeah, is that what it is? I I think I see it as like the way he from the way he's reacting. Right, it's that his whole goal was to bring the celestial dragons down, but right now he's saying that they'll be dragged down e either way, even Regardless. though he's going to be an impelled out and he mm -hmm. kind of accepted that he's going to be impelled out because he mentions like oh bring the newspaper so i can at least read what's going on uh -huh. so like for me it seems like he's still like kind of uh satisfied with the outcome because his uh he's, his goal is still going to be achieved i mean even though it's not directly through him he did right set now. it up though he just set it up he did true. set it up by supplying Kyle yeah 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 service. true true so it's like in a way he he won't be outside to be like pulling the string yeah. for it to happen but he's still the one that accelerated everything true so because like the way he's reacting seems like he has a plan still you know like the way he's acting mm -hmm. like still like laughing it off like he's very chill about it nonchalant about the whole thing like yeah. he's like oh i got caught not a big deal but like for someone like him i would have accepted him i would have expected him to kind of be like having a meltdown because like his whole goal to take the celestial dragons down wouldn't be a be able to be accomplished mm -hmm. but it's like at the end of the day it's still going to be accomplished that's why he's still satisfied with this True. outcome right yeah okay we need to see the part after this because that's Kaido shit, right? Like, One of Kaido's what, shit. Like, the fire and everything? Like, what are they trying to hint here? Like, what's going on? Is Dofi gonna somehow get out of this? <laughs> right? That's what I was thinking. Why did it catch on fire? I don't know. They're so, kind of so, playing it off like as if like he could be saved. Because then these guys see the ships and yeah. then they're like, no, we're saving him. So it's like, why would they even show that if they're not even gonna like be successful or anything like that? So that one guy just saying right now, is he just saying like the force transporting Doflamingo is so great it could destroy a country? Is that what he's saying right here? Yeah. Cause the... They're using so much force just to transport. Yeah. Because Fujitori is there, Sengoku is there, Suru is there. The lineup. Cause yeah. yeah, the lineup. Are they gonna destroy a country? That's, that's, what he's, that's what he's saying. They can't yeah, take him! Goku, I'm still gonna yeah. be like... How? That's crazy. This guy's gonna take down 
have no idea. Fuji tour. But he, they don't have to take them down though. Like they just have to retrieve Joker and run. They'll have to break the ship and like retrieve. It's kind of like you know, if Annie's lobby and stuff like that. Like we've had encounters where it's like the opponent's strong. We just have to get away. It could work. Like it, it does seem difficult. It'd be weird for them to show us that, and then he doesn't escape. Yeah, you know, like they go try and then they lose. Yeah, so it's like, what's the whole point of showing us that? So yeah. can we assume that he gets out? I don't know. Okay, he does. <laughs> okay, let's say Dolphy's mind is too brilliant to be kept yeah. into this little like jail cell. Okay, yeah. so so Kaido's crew is gonna break him out. Is he gonna get punished? Is he's gonna join Kaido. I think the question for me would be like, what if he got if he got out? Then would the fight with Kaido not come to play anymore? Then no, it'll still come to play. It'll still come to play because Kaido's angry that they even got to that point. Yeah, like, this, like that. they messed with him. That they messed with him. They messed with him. True. The king of beasts. Uh huh. Right. Mm-hmm. Wouldn't that be enough already? I don't know if it'll punish Dofi. Like, True. if you're getting attacked, you know, you did your best, you know, you, you, you lost. Yeah. Like, I don't know if he's the type to punish yeah. Dofi, but right now, like, for some reason, there's orders to, to retrieve, to him, retrieve yeah. and save Joker. So, are these orders though, or like, do they know? Like, do you think Kylo already knows that Doflamingo was caught then? I think so. Mm. What, when you, what do you say, like, um, it took a few days. Yeah, yeah. So wouldn't that be spread all over the news already? Because like their bounty went up, right? That means Kaido must have found out. But I guess my question would be like... We might be... Uh, we might be uh, doubting these guys then? Because if Kaido was aware and he gave orders to these guys specifically to go retrieve uh, Dofi, so, they should so also know like what kind of people would be trying to transport <sighs> Dofi, right? So, so you're saying they're strong? I think well, so. Well, this one, this one guy is saying, Captain Jack, <laughs> you know, is believing in himself. Yeah. He's like, who do you think I am? Yeah. I'm gonna go take him back. Yeah. Hmm. Like, maybe, like you said, like, um, maybe they don't have to fight and defeat Fujitora. Like maybe he has like a door door fruit kind of thing. Whoop, and you yeah. Save him and then just kind of disappear, kind of. Uh-huh. But that means we're gonna see Dofi again. That's also why I feel kind of weird about it because I'm like I also don't see that happening. Like it feels like this chapter is closed with Dofi from Dressrosa. Is it closed? But I don't know. That's what I mean. But like everything's that they've set up so far, it's like it should be closed now. Like we know his backstory. We know like what he was up to this whole time. And then, like, the, it's supposed to kind of just, like, it feels... Like closure. Yeah. It feels natural for us to just lead into Kaido True. now. Okay. Through him. But it's like, if they bring him back now, it's like, feels weird. Because it's like, the whole point of him was to... For me, personally, it felt more like he... The purpose of him was to lead us into this fight with Kaido. But if they bring him back, then it's like, well... <laughs> they can bring him back indirectly. How so? Like, they save Dofi. Mm-hmm. But he's not involved with the whole Kaido versus straw hats or whatever they save him and then he right. goes and does his own thing because mm. he's like you said he's still laughing he's still smirking yeah like he had like he's has everything figured out or something yeah. like he could essentially pull another like um crocodile where mm. oh i have my next venture i'm gonna go do it like he's done with dress rosa uh-huh. but that doesn't mean he's done with the game like he probably has like his mind is so mm. great he probably has other things mm. figured out right so you're saying because of like his personality, he still has the fire in him that if he were to get out, you're saying that he still has plans. He's not someone that, he doesn't seem like a person that's being defeated. Defeated, yeah. True. Isn't that crazy? He's laughing. Yeah, that's, that's why I was like thrown off. I'm like, I would have expected him to kind of be like down a little yeah. bit. Yeah, right. But he was like hysterical. Like, is that how charismatic he is? I don't know. I don't know, like, I don't know if just, he was just doing it to fuck with Suru, though. That's what he was doing with, like, Luffy and everyone. We could tell if he was yeah. tired or whatever. He's always just smiling. Yeah, like. yeah. Yeah, I don't know. It could, maybe. Maybe that's enough. Like, he, he led us to Kaido, but then Kaido probably still wants him to reinforce. He doesn't need to, technically, he doesn't even need to listen to Kaido. 
like Kaido maybe like wants to like rescue Joker, mm -hmm. but after like Joker saved, he doesn't even listen to Kaido. How's he gonna find him? But Kaido could kill him. That was the whole thing. Is he was scared that Kaido will kill him? Yeah, Kaido will kill him. But yeah. technically, he could he could escape before they ship him to Kaido. Oh, but if the guy's strong enough to retrieve Dofi from them, I'm assuming. <laughs> I'm I, assuming he, they know. could take Dofi too. It's, it's hard. It's hard to believe, but right? maybe. Yeah. But I'm just like scenarios how he would escape and not yeah. be a part of this whole thing. Because you say it's kind yeah. of weird he comes back. Yeah. Right. It's like Crocodile came back in a way that oh he's we know he's free, but that, yeah. that that's pretty much it. I think another weird thing was like him being like, are we going to impel down and just bringing the newspaper every day? Because like I would have assumed that the Celestial Dragons would have wanted to just off him. Yeah. Right? True. Because of like the whole incident that he caused with mm -hmm. the national treasure and all that. So it's like... Can they off him though? Why not? I don't know. That never been like a question to me. Like, why didn't they off him? Because they couldn't off him? They couldn't find him? I guess, I guess like no, we this... talked about it before, and you said that it was because uh, prior to him becoming a Seven Warlord, they couldn't get him. They and couldn't then, get him, and yeah. then he gave this proposal for the Seven Warlords, and it's like, okay, fine, we'll just keep him to keep an eye out and keep him in check, right? And we also benefit from it. I thought that was the reason that we came up with, but Can... it's like at this point, it's like I don't, I still don't understand why they wouldn't kill him if they bring him to Impel Down. He's like here assuming that, hey, like, I'm just going to be the reading newspaper. And I'm like, because we were thinking, no, you're going to die when you get can, to him. Can the Elder Star save him? Or the Celestial Dragon save him? Then You know how he pulled strings before? Yeah. Can he pull strings now? But I don't know if he was pulling... Sh but that's because we were assuming that he was only pulling strings because they can't catch he him. had the information about the National Treasure. Not yeah. that he has a direct relation with... The cel a celestial dragon. Because yeah. if he does have a direct relation with the celestial dragon, technically speaking, they should be able to get him out of Impel Down. But they don't know that. But it's, uh, the it's absolute. Like, Navy and them don't know that right now. Oh, you're saying the Navy. Oh, right, because they don't know about they his don't... celestial dragon. Yeah, they, they don't know about that. That's true. That's true. But do you think he actually has a connection with a celestial dragon? Or is it just because he knows about the national treasure? That that's what the threat he used. But would, would it would it okay? Now here's another thing. Would it be weird? Let's say he did um somehow got Celestial Dragon to help him. Would it be weird if they kind of see him kind of half Celestial Dragon, be locked up in Impel Down? How would that even? How would that sh like go towards their looks? Like no one knows he's a Celestial Dragon, but would the Celestial Dragons want like? A half celestial dragon in Impel Down, but I think because he's half, they don't care. They don't right? care, right? Because they already see him as trash. Yeah, that's that's the thing. He's like, half. it's kind of weird how he even pulled off the first time, but because he know the national treasure, yeah. maybe he used that to like leverage it. Yeah, that's why I'm thinking it's the national treasure, not that he has a direct relation with anybody as a celestial dragon. Do you think he can leverage it again? I don't think they can because he's already here. Like, what is he going to do about that national treasure? Because I think the whole thing was that they didn't want him to spread the word yeah. about it because mm -hmm. it's supposed to be a secret, right? Yeah. So it's like, back when he was out, that was a possible threat because he could say it to tell anybody yeah. because he wasn't locked up. But mm -hmm. now that they, they caught him then he's locked up, who is he going to tell? So, so you're saying that because now they're technically under Navy, maybe under Elder Stars, they could just off him. I feel like they can. That's why when he was talking about this, I was like, this is kind of weird. Like, they kind of have the power to just kill you right now. But do you, th so you're, you kind of- Get rid of like the so whole issue. Technically, we, we could say like he's still on his high horse and he still thinks he's invincible. Do you, do, you think, oh. do, you, do you think that could be it? Like, sorry, I need you to give me a newspaper every day, but we don't know the outcome of him. True. Like, so yeah, they, we saw him transporting mm. and stuff. Technically, they never show us. Kaido saving mm -hmm. him or him at all, we don't. Mm -hmm. We wouldn't even know what would happen. To him. So you're saying like he doesn't even realize what's coming for him. Like that could a that could be a p as well. possibility. What do you think? Yeah, that could also be it. That, that could that could justify what he's saying. Like give me the yeah newspaper yeah. I'm just like, we're, what are you talking yeah, about? Yeah, where we're like, you kind of know too much, and yeah. now you're in the position of the yeah. celestial dragons yeah. to kill you. 
Yeah, like you were a huge problem. To to just them. get rid of you. Then, yeah, then no one would like, know the national treasure, right? Yeah, exactly. That's what I was thinking. <sighs> kind of sad. I kind of want him to live. But... Me too. But we'll see. We'll see. Like Kyle <laughs> seems like they're trying to get him. But it's like, I don't know if he will still add value to the plot if he lived at this point. Because like, if like that's why I'm saying it feels like the chapter is closed in yeah. because Because what would he, what value would he add to the plot after aside Wait. from just like existing and like being like an evil genius but it's like nothing set up anymore for him to add value for like the general plot you know what i mean can you see like them introducing something new later on and they tie it with him that would still be hype like if like now if they ever showed like something that crocodile did it would still be yeah. hype right but like i'm saying as of right now he has nothing he lost everything already like what's he even gonna do he doesn't have a country he doesn't have titles he doesn't even have his crew like what is he gonna do he has like maybe kaido could help him but like again i don't i don't know what he would do with that like he would just he would just be the evil genius but guy. you know how he has so many connections mm -hmm. don't you think any of those people could just take him in okay okay maybe remember all those snails that's ringing? true that's like, true he's a popular guy that is true what do you want the popular guy to be on your side like he is that's charismatic true. right that's i could true. i could see him somehow like ex mm. doing something true. else I so don't you're know saying if he escapes because of like his charisma and like all these connections he has he could stir things up even more later because, on, whatever it is because he has like all these strings attached to people yeah maybe bring bring him back for the end game like true okay maybe i could see that then yeah like if we're talking about like his connections with other people because i was solely just thinking about like his crew directly yeah, yeah, yeah. but you're right there are a lot of people that have connections with him and and do like him like calling him to check up on him and stuff they, like that they do yeah like a business relationship like a business kind of relation yeah true. Thanks for watching everyone. If you guys enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up. It really helps out the channel. And if you're new here, make sure to hit the subscribe button below. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Peace.